Hey everybody, so tonight uh, I am joined with Eric Von Rothkirch. Uh, so Rick was supposed to be here. Um, he has swimmer's ear. So he felt really terrible. He really wanted to be here, but um, yeah, apparently he got some medicine for it. He thought he was going to be fine, and then yeah, it was bothering him way too much. So, and we talked about it before, that I was going to try to get Eric to come on the stream, answer some questions about level design and whatnot. <clears throat> so, he's here. Eric, you can say hi now. Hey, how's it going, everybody? So, can you guys hear me? Can everybody hear him okay? Yay, nay. <clears throat> yes. Okay, perfect. Okay, so... Um, this is going to kind of be like the other times that we have team members on. We're just going to be playing. We'll be sure to answer questions. Where's Joel? Joel's at home. I mean, I guess. Uh, he'll. I'll get Joel to come here sometime. Um, I was definitely trying to have Eric here. Well, the plan was to have him here next week. And then, you know, Rick kind of had to, to drop out. So, but... Hey everybody, um, so I'm going to go ahead and we're going to click over and we're just going to start playing. Uh, go ahead and ask some questions. How's the prefab world going? So you already have questions, Eric. Look at that. Yeah, I know. Look at that. Okay. Prefab world is going all right. <laughs> wind it, wind, winding down the prefab production from Alpha 19 and, and starting to think about prefabs we could drop maybe in patches or Alpha 20. So... Exciting stuff. Crazy to be talking about new content at work. I know, right? Your partner tonight is a level designer? Yes. Yes. He's one of the guys who made most of the POIs in the game. Uh, right? Maybe, maybe like half. I don't know. Okay. About half. Who made Modern um, House 14? 14? <laughs> Which one is 14? I was about to say, man, if you know it just off the top of your head, like 14, uh, that's me. That's me. Oh, <laughs> uh, that might be uh, Hernan. Hernan Cortez. No. Uh, Hernan from the community, I think. Oh. Um, I forgot his community name. What's his community name? Hernan? <laughs> I, I think so, but I, I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, I think it's the same one. We need to double the number of and sleepers, possibly triple. Oh, and a reminder, man. everybody, uh, the alerts are turned off because we do put these out to uh, YouTube, you know, onto the seven days official uh, YouTube. So just letting you know. Thank you, everybody. Uh, okay, so I'm not even done with my starter quest. And since you don't even have a shirt on, I'm assuming you're not done with yours either. No. I guess I should do that, huh? So I'm not naked. Yeah. <laughs> it's very very indecent of us to show up naked. <laughs> Slackers. I know, right? We are we're just taking our time here. We're relaxing. You know, we're not really that worried about the zombie threat. We're just just hanging out. Question for Eric. How many POIs for future builds are ideas from you and from the community mod realm? I think that question means, do you get any ideas from the mods, or do you guys just come up with them all yourself? Uh, I don't really look at mods that much, although because we brought in some people from the, the mod community to help us out, uh, I have looked at them more recently. Um, I started looking at what people are making, and I think there was a little bit of lag time with, like, between like Alpha 16, Alpha 17, Alpha 18, um, and with the editor tools kind of coming online and getting better, it, it, it took a while for people to catch up a little bit to what we were doing, but they're starting to catch up now and do some interesting stuff uh, that, you know, is, is starting to look more like what we build at work, so um, it's, getting, it's getting interesting. Uh, and hopefully that'll continue as we work towards maybe an eventual uh, Steam Workshop. 
um, we'll get more and more interesting stuff being built. Cool. Is uh, has everybody seen any? Oh man, stream is buffering a little bit. Uh, it's been doing that. I don't know what's causing it. It should pass in just a moment. Where did you go? Oh, you know what? We should probably party up. Yeah, we forgot to do that, I think. I don't, I don't think we're even near each other at the moment. All right. Let's see here. Did you send me something? Yeah, if you press uh, I and then look in there, you should find the invite. Then we can figure out, because I think we ran two different directions. Okay, so let's see. Uh, are we going to see more POIs with end bosses like the boar and corn POI? Sorry, don't know its name. Yeah, uh, I would like to. I mean, I would love to have more like custom flavor type quest POIs if we could get it. Um, some of that depends on Mr. Prime. <laughs> uh, I am all for it. Uh, <laughs> I'm definitely yeah. We, yeah. When you get when you get custom strings and add names to POIs and start start adding a little bit of flavor to the quests, yeah. Then if we get that kind of support, absolutely, I would love to. Um, yeah. No, 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 definitely. <laughs> chop, chop, Brian. Hey, I'm I'm working on stuff. A question about resource stacking. First stack gets like 19k XP, drops fast, but it's easy to levels or so without doing but stacking and unpack. Horn, I'm not sure what you're talking about. <laughs> Are you talking about the, the bundle stuff where you bundle it and then you like you craft it and do the bundle and then you unpack it and then rebundle it over and over again? Because someone told me about that earlier, and we couldn't reproduce it. It doesn't give XP. So... The testers are looking for a repro. <clears throat> but yeah, I, we weren't able to do it at all earlier. Yeah, that's the part we couldn't repro, is it giving the insane amount of XP. Because in the XML, it's set to not give you XP for crafting those. At all. Oh, he's aggroed on me. I thought he was aggroed on you. Oh, no. I'm... You're like already a mile away. <laughs> no, I've, you ran past me. <laughs> I'm coming to you, though. Wait, what did I do with my... Hold on. Nope. I'm a little bit behind because I'm reading reading chat, so I fell behind a little bit. Yeah. Will trainers and quest eye. rewards be game staged in Alpha Twenty? That is the current plan. Is to yes, do that. Um, we'll see. Um, okay, so I need a stone axe because I broke mine. Hey, what's up, buddy? Stop it. Stop it. I'm trying to answer questions. Never would. Eric, what would be the one POI that you really want to make? Uh, should I say? I, mean, <laughs> it's, I don't think it hurts anything. Uh, area 52. <laughs> It would be like kind of like the sequel to Red Mesa, but like way more awesome, and not built in Alpha 15 or whatever. It'd be built now or in a year from now. I don't know. Horn, you may just have to like record a video of it for me or something because yeah, we were not able to reproduce that. <clears throat> Um, is there anything interesting we should 
Let me <laughs> know about the next patch, like warning us about the faster chickens made me stock up on running too. So I get my on. Uh, that's awesome. Um, I didn't even know about the faster chickens. Um, uh, so that that makes me want to just make things up, like you know, like murderous zombie rabbits that are five feet tall. Watch out we, for those. We have talked about zombie squirrels. I don't think seriously, <laughs> but we have talked about it. Um, yeah. Did you finish your quest? Mine? Yeah, oh, because crap. the trader's that way. Uh, yes. How yes. many people are on the level design team? Uh, depends on how you count. Um, it would be me and Brad and her name and Sebastian and Rick sometimes and Alex. So, like... Six, roughly, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how many we end up with. We just keep collecting designers, so. <laughs> you know, it's like stray cats that show up at your door. You just feed them, and they, uh, they do stuff. They catch mice, and... <laughs> Question for Eric, would you personally want to add a highway system that connects towns and cities in Navisgain and RWG? Um, would I personally want to do it? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think how you worded that question, you were asking him if he wanted to do just a ton of work by himself. And Yeah, do I personally want to build a huge highway system? Not me personally. Mm -mm. But if, like, socket-supported highways or something, then I would build highways and, it, like, random gen would just piece them together or something. Maybe. I mean, I don't know. Depends on how much work I have to do. Uh, let me see. Um, this is not a level design question, but is there lore behind the whites? All the other zombies were obviously human, but the whites seem to be something else. I think we're going to cover lore... In some of the later alphas. I don't know if we have something written down for the whites or not, or if we just said, man, that's cool. Last man. You guys still accepting that? Your advice last stream was inspiring. Oh, telling you to go build stuff and make stuff for Go I don't even remember what he's talking about. Uh, I, I do, I do. Somebody <laughs> asked, had asked me if they wanted to do level design, how they would go about getting into it. and I was saying, just start building stuff, and you're going to need a lot of practice. So, you know, go jump down the rabbit hole of like a year or two building stuff and see where you went, wind up. Um, you know, if you, if you practice it enough over a long enough period of time, you know, you might get pretty good. But... Um, that was inspiring. So you got to do two years of work <laughs> before before you can. I think I told my story that I spent two years practicing level design before I got hired by Electronic Arts uh, to work on a double seven game or something. And somebody found it inspiring, I guess. Hmm. To me, it's like ah. Oh, I look back at that. I'm like that was really difficult. <laughs> uh, but yeah, go for it. Go put in a year or two. And see where you end up. I'm not going to discourage anybody from doing that. Oh, they want me to make a bow? He's developed. Gosh. Tell me to do stuff. Thanks for the raid, Lauren. Sharks with lasers. Um, I don't know if those are coming anytime soon. So we got a question from Turtle Raid. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> trying to read, trying to read questions, and I'm like, Turtle Raid. What's going on? Yeah, it's day one because our last save game was broken. So. What about attack turtles? I don't know. I mean, I'm not really against any of that, but I don't think that's going to... I don't know if any of that's going to make it in. Alligators would be awesome, though. Wouldn't that be terrifying? You go in the water and an alligator pops out? 
That's Space scary. for Ace asked, did Eric come up with Munch's carpet? Yes, I am the filthy mind <laughs> that came up with Munch's carpet. You didn't have to admit to it. You're not, like, under oath or anything. <laughs> you know, I couldn't think of a name, and I was like, well, let's just make it funny, and that'll make it easier. And it did. They so. use their shells to collect water? That's terrible. You're going to be... You want us to murder turtles? That's... That's wrong, man. Are we running to the trader now? I'm like still hanging around this little town. I mean, we probably should. I need to repair my axe and build my... I guess I did build my coin. Oh, shoot. My favorite part was mini bikes for dumb shits. I laughed so hard when I found that. Yeah. Oh no, we're buffering again. I don't know what's going on tonight, everybody, but we are buffering. I'll just uh, read questions while it buffers. Hopefully no, no, we're good. Killed by his own. No, 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 no. I mean, the stream is buffering. You can still play. No, I know. Space for said, I had a feeling, Eric, that you did. How do you know it was me? Wow. <laughs> you just got called <laughs> out. <laughs> I, I had a feeling me. it was that Eric dude. <laughs> That's... You don't know me! <laughs> T5 quest. Are DJ, be there's only two of us. There's, there, there's only two of us. Poopy pants was not me. Yeah. Okay. Um, everybody, uh, I said it before. Uh, this was not like some sort of bait and switch. Uh, Rick was supposed to be here, but he's got swimmer's ear, and he could not join. So, he felt terrible. He really wanted to be here. Even though I had to look it up at first. I'm like, is Swimmer's ear really a thing? Or is he just, you know, making stuff up? But, no, it's really a thing. And I think I've had it before, and I just didn't know what it was called. But, yeah. Did you call it Farmer's ear? Yeah, I said Swimmer's <laughs> ear. Oh, I thought you said Farmer. I was like, are we changing the name of it now? <laughs> that would have been funny if he said that. He's like, oh, I got Farmer's <laughs> ear. Or tennis ear or something like that. It's it's an ear or something. What did I, I tell you? Was up, the cows are calling me. The cows and the chickens are calling me with my farmer's ear. That'd be awesome. Uh, how do you bring up menu to select block shapes? Yeah, you just hold R. Here, I'll, I'll show you. Um, we'll make a frame. And then we have a frame. And then now we'll come here, we hold R, we go to the top, and then boom, there you go. When making a POI, do you have a weapon or combo weapons mind to clear? Y yes, actually, we uh, set up some tester defaults for that, actually, where we decided, you know, on a good range of weapons that would be available for tier one or two or three. And so we do kind of have some weapons in mind to clear based on how far we think the player would be along at that point. And yeah, so the answer is yes. Yeah, we are getting some buffering. I don't I don't know what's going on tonight, everybody. There should be nothing different about my internet tonight. What POIs are being reworked? For stable builds in my team? You mean as opposed to experimental? Uh, there might be a few more. There might be another new remnant and a couple other things and some new updates. Um, um, we are planning some other shenanigans, which I'm not going to talk about. Here, so whenever you head this way, there's a wolf in between us. Whenever what? When you head this way, which I'm assuming you're coming this way, there's a wolf. Oh, there's a wolf? Yeah. No big deal. So basically basically what you're saying is I'm going to die by wolf pretty soon. No. I got gotcha. you. I see a chicken, though. Can I go hit it with my club? Where'd it go? Oh, he's running from me. If you can he catch it. Gonna... I already killed a rabbit with my axe like, right away. Oh, no. He's too fast. That's a ninja chicken. He's way too fast. Oh my god. Did they up, did they up chicken speed? That yeah, that's what they were fast. talking about. 
Joel and his sneaky chickens. Oh man. I see almost you. died. I you saved died? your life though. No, I almost died. Is what I said. Oh, I see it delayed on the screen. You fighting the wolf. Ooh. Let me see. I need to repair my axe. If I can. I'm good. Are you harvesting that guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good. We're, uh, I'm a little infected. <laughs> Rick has knuckle with a beer. <laughs> Uh, 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 another larger POI chain of Lathan's hardware. I think there should be another Lathan's hardware. There really should be. There really should be. I was thinking about making it like the hardware store that went out of business. Like, <laughs> okay, now you're just rubbing salt. In the now you're just, now you're just being hurtful. <laughs> Lathan didn't manage his chain very well, so it went under. <laughs> Way before that. You just can't compete with working steps. Nobody can. It's not your fault. <laughs> I had one arrow. Should I just make that zombie mad? Sure. And then I'll pretend to kill him and die. Probably. No, we got him. That's fine. Hey, I'm pretty okay. nice right next to the dead zombie. Lathan's amusement park. Now that, that that might be a bit much. That 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 will give Lathan an ego. He'll be like, <laughs> I own everything in this game. I have my own amusement park. Hey, that would be amazing. I would be cool with that. <laughs> That's. I I like Chat's ideas here. <laughs> well, I like some of their ideas. Some of them. I see someone said Lathan's wigs, and I'm not down with that one. <laughs> Lathan's uh, wigs. <laughs> Some of the other ones, I'm I'm all for. Lathan's Knuckle Rub Nightclub. I mean, <laughs> not, rub nightclub. not my first um, choice, but I mean, I'll take it. I guess. Keep clear of me. I have a new cell tower to replace this Alpha Twelve cell tower. Um, man, the distances on these quests are not optimal. Oh, you're the other direction. Never mind. I mean, I'm at the trader. You need to come do the trader quest. Oh, there you go. Giant mall. How did I run? I ran just past the trader somehow and didn't even notice it. Yeah, no, it's this place. Kind of a nice area. So we are on pre-gen 02, everybody. I normally end up playing pre-gen 01 all the time, so I thought it'd be nice for us to switch it up. Yeah, I don't... No, I don't have a favorite PY. It's kind of hard when there's like 300 of them. <laughs> I, I like a lot of them. I have like maybe 25 favorite POIs. All the Lathan's second rate hardware store. Oh, come on. Now now we really are pouring salt in the wound. I mean that's <laughs> That's like saying Lathan's shitty shack or something. <laughs> like we're just We're just being mean now. Favoli got an academy, by the way. I mean I just want to point that out. Well he might have his name taken off the academy. <laughs> Did you turn in your quest? And then see if there's any other quests uh, that are nearby. Oh, sorry. I was, I was reading chat. No, no, no. Since oh. I'm safe inside the trader. Lathan's outhouse. Uh. <laughs> what should I do? Should I get a quest? Uh, okay, so look through the quests. If there's any that are under, let's say, 600 meters. What's the closest quest you have that's not buried supplies? Clear zombies at 613. Let's do it. Grab that. Now everybody, I do apologize for all the buffering. I do not know why it just decided. Actually, it seems to have cleared up now. 
But for some reason, it was like, hey, I'm just going to buffer. Okay, so now press oh. O and then click on the quest and then there's a little share symbol next yeah. to the, it's like the little people at the top. Eric, did you have your hand in the new ranger stations? They're very well done, but they need more landmines. Uh, no. That wasn't me. Oh. Sorry. And Jeff, I don't know the reason why, I mean, I know we don't just... We don't just let everything be available as far as the building materials, you know, for shapes. Um, yeah, I don't know the exact reason why. He oh, highlighted man. the speaking of block shapes. Why aren't the full complement of shapes, wood and concrete, available to the player to use in construction? And that I, I honestly don't know. Probably because they wouldn't all fit in the menu, and then you'd be looking at the mess that level designers look at, which you probably don't want to look at all the. That's probably the main reason. Because a standard player is only going to really care about, you know, so many. That's why we had things like the table saw that would hold the rest. Oh, we need to we need to find somewhere to like, hang out. It's, it's nighttime. I want to look around and see if there's a nice POI we can kind of clear out real quick yeah we can do that something small you guys thought about shrinking the skyscrapers uh, <laughs> yes but it would be crazy amount of work it would be I could I could see that being okay so here, how about this building this POI that I built Yes. <laughs> this POI that you built. Sure. Oh, damn. Um, and I don't even remember the way to get into my own POI. It might be in the back. I think it's in the back. If you want the easy way in. Oh, that's fine. I always like the easy way in. By the way, good job, Alan and Sasha. Painting all that stuff. <laughs> I know it was probably painful. Alright. We'll just clear out all these knuckle heads. These knuckle rubs. <laughs> okay. It's gonna be random dudes in the different rooms or not. Oh, come on. <laughs> Alright. So, no more guys in here, no more guys in here. There might be guys around here. Oh. I know where they all are, yes. Toilet pistol? No. Nope. We're cheating, because I know where everybody is. More or less. I mean, it's <laughs> random, but... I chose the randomness, so... I am the decider of the randomness. Oh, there's guys up here. Surprise, surprise. Um, I probably shouldn't have triggered them. There's gonna be maybe a guy in here? Yes. Okay. Um, I just need a little bit of stand back and then we can get back to reading. In a minute we'll get back to reading questions. We just need to clear this POI. We can hang out here for the night. Oh, man. Alright. After this main area, there's only the master bedroom to clear. So. It will then maybe one guy in the garage. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Guy in the garage. Oh, two guys in the garage. Oh. Oh, I tricked you. Yeah, you did. Uh oh. This lady is really mad. She's gonna kill me. Uh, I can't get away. Hold on. I about to say, don't die because we don't have a bedroll here. That's the, like literally the next thing we should do. Yeah. Okay. Is he getting up? Yeah, he's getting up. Okay. That was the... Is that everybody? That should be. That was the guys guarding the 
the treasure. So. Anything good? Uh, there's some armor if you want it. I took it, sorry. <laughs> you can take the rest of the stuff if you want. Oh, this. I need some pills. Of course I don't get them, though. Of course not. You want this scrap glove armor? All I got was boots, and I didn't get that much good stuff, actually. Well, this was not... I'll do the padded leg armor. I, I got some in here. You're all good. I, got a ton of I do have a padded... I have padded gloves here. I, I, I went with the scrap one, so... I'll take the padded... Um... Pull a pistol, pull a pistol. Oh, of course not. Let me see if I can remember where the secrets are. Not very difficult, but... Oh. Everybody's like, follow him so that I can see where these secrets are. Ah, there's a safe. Oh, cooking grill. I'm gonna go back upstairs. Oh yeah, there's something right here. Okay. Is it, isn't it sad that I actually remember what I placed where in like every POI pretty much? <laughs> Question, who did the Red Mesa? Because it looks awesome. That was me. Aw shucks. You got me. I updated. I built the original one in like L15. And wasn't happy with its decay since Alpha 15. Ooh, I was like, fun. this should look cool for Alpha 19, so that's what I did. Oh, I got a paintbrush. We're all good. <laughs> we can now master the apocalypse. Yep. We got this. Game over, everybody. Alright. As soon as I'm not, like, looting the entire house, I'm gonna read the chat. Yeah. Where should we hide out? Is there a place in this house we should hide? Why am I asking you, though? <laughs> you just talked about, I made this place and I know everything about it. Where should we hide, though? Is hey, there a safe room? <laughs> Come up here to the second floor. Let me see if you notice something. Oh, hold on, hold on. Ooh, I got some shades. And some boots. Lathan's outhouse? You yes. guys are just getting silly now. I know. Now we're just now we're just getting mildly hurtful, everybody. Like, once again, Robert got a tower, Favali got a uh, an academy, an academy and, and I got a hardware shack. And now you're downgrading it to let's just give him an outhouse. Alright, let's see. I'm like five pages behind. <laughs> yeah, everybody just ask your questions again because we are going to be behind on your. Updated Trader Prey POIs in A20? Ah, uh, maybe. I, I know we talked about it, we just didn't say when. I mean, as far as I there know. Might, there, there might be something cooking there. We'll see. Hey, I feel like uh, some zombies are coming in. Question for Eric. Let me make sure you check points and other time. Uh, yes. I want to do what's called uh, micro or mini POIs. They're like just checkpoints and or like a crash ambulance or you know something that is just tells a little bit of a story in the apocalypse. But it's like maybe I don't know a POI that's like five meters by five meters or ten meters by ten meters. It's not like a full POI. It's just like a little vignette, so to speak. Of, something that happened. Um, yeah, I would love to do more stuff like that once we get more like real POIs you know, out of the way. Hey, Lathan, did you see this? Well, Look around in this. There's another toilet. Damn it, never a toilet pistol. Do you notice any loot in this hallway anywhere? Any other than that backpack? Oh, that up there? Yeah, okay, good. You did see it. I didn't you see did it until you told me to come back in here. I mean, technically. <clears throat> oh, it's nice now. Lathan's happy ending massage parlor. I don't know about that one. Oh, hey, do you need a uh, 
Stone Axe. There's a tier two in the working stiff crate up there. Um, do you have a tier two arm? Yeah, I do. Actually, there's, oh, there's two of them two. in there anyway. Oh yeah, well then I'll take one. You'll have to go grab it. I, I, I didn't grab it. I was... Any knuckle rubs this evening? Nope. Rick did not make it tonight. He has swimmer's ear or farmer's ear. It's, it's one of those. No. <laughs> scuba diver's ear or something I mean he, that's something <laughs> and I'm caught up Trader late all he does is give quests he doesn't do <laughs> <laughs> I don't sell. I don't sell nothing. <laughs> so you can go do stuff for me. He has the most quests, but he doesn't give you as much reward. <laughs> He's like cheap. Like, well, thanks for doing it, but here's your here's your fifty dukes. <laughs> what? All right, so. Uh... Hmm. Kind of thinking about. It. <clears throat> you know, this was the POI that I uh, tested Ragdoll Audio on mm -hmm. from the roof. Because if you stand on a roof, kind of like you can drop guys onto the front steps. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's there's a little trivia for you. Lathan needs to be a trader, given he's the primary quest programmer. I mean, I'm not, not going to disagree. I just... I don't know if you all want to see this in-game all the time. You all already had to sit through the Trader Gen cosplay. <clears throat> oh, boy. That's, that's pretty terrifying. Yeah, I, I think I missed that. Well, I caught part of it. <laughs> Made all of us I... uncomfortable. All yeah. of us. Yeah. Everybody, even me. I was busy working the day that stream got shared around, and I was like, uh, I need to get work done and not be made really uncomfortable. Oh, good. Hey, <laughs> don't worry. We keep posting clips. <laughs> I would do a mission for Low Dukes just to hear sassy comebacks from the traitor. <laughs> get rid of those ghost blocks uh that i honestly don't know i don't know why you're getting those i think you might be talking about uh imposters. Imposter. yeah i still don't know how to get rid of them i mean <clears throat> oh do we want to make better rolls oh i mean we probably should I mean, even if this isn't going to be our long-term home, it would be just good to put, you know. I stuff. made a little little hidey hole up here. Or yeah, you did. Look at you, you're like freaking Spider-Man. <clears throat> yeah. It's that designer intuition of this might be the safer place. <laughs> if, if guys came into this POI, I don't know if I'd trust any place, though. Let's see, I need to put some points into a few things. First of all, and then you can like walk around on the ledge and get some healing guys. factor going. Something's outside. Yeah. Mm, maybe I'll go. Here we go. A giant, a giant mm. pet shop with all the animals running around in cages of vultures. And you know, I was at the Dallas Aquarium the other day, and. uh it got me thinking about a zoo POI, but 
it would be really hard to do because it would just have like vultures and what? I mean, mount would you lions. get a rabbit? <clears throat> yeah, mountain lions. It have like the same. It have like wolves and mountain lions, bears and vultures and bears and boars. I guess boars. I mean, so you got a few. Like, some deer. We could have like we could have like five exhibits or like six <laughs> exhibits maybe. Maybe that would be enough. I mean, I was gonna say I, I think that would be okay. I mean, hey, coyotes, yeah. You know? I mean, you probably do have enough. Can we make the skyscraper POIs bigger? Absolutely give the finger to downtown zone. <laughs> uh, I don't think I would want to make them any bigger. <clears throat> you guys have no idea how much stuff I had to pull out of my butt. To update the Sean Tower, it was like old men sacks and robber, robber baron finance and uh, or robber finance, rob bear finance. That's what it was. And uh, Mad Mole's gym. I I had to actually give a nod to Mad Mole again <laughs> by doing Mad Mole's gym. You don't know how how hard that was. <laughs> uh, and then, uh, what else? I can't remember what, what all the other floors were. It's a blur now. You could have put in a prime electronics. I mean, it's too late now we have the Mo Power. But... Well, see, now it would have to be the off brand that's like. Like the Lathan's hardware of the uh, universe here? Yeah, the Lathan's <laughs> hardware of electronics. Do you really want that? I mean, mm -hmm. at this point, I already have the, <laughs> the Lathan's hardware. <laughs> I might as well have two of the, <laughs> the second rate chains. All right, I can make you an electronic store, Lathan's Electronics. There's like a just guy just started electronics. attaching his name. People will be like, why is this guy attaching his name to every type of store? It's fine. He can get over it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh yeah, they're in here with us. And that's why I wanted to hide in the ceiling. Got this. Actually. Oh my god, she ducked no. and weaved. Oh my god, what was that? It was like the Matrix right there. And I have no. Oh, me. There we go. I'm just gonna chop everything. Oh man, come on. Okay, anyway. We do have zombie labs where they bust out. I thought there were some in Higashi unless they're not breaking out properly anymore, I don't know. Let's see. To keep performance acceptable, uh, I just don't use like everything, and I try to. We have a measurement of like vert count and triangle count, and I try to keep them as low as I can. Um, the rule of thumb that I personally use is kind of like 150,000 for like tier one, 200,000 tier two. 300,000 tier 3. Then once it gets to tier 4 and 5, then you kind of throw it out the window because you're usually making a bigger POI where, like, you're never going to keep it under, like, 400 probably just, just because of the amount of space. But, um, we just try to... Oops, I didn't need to do that. Just deleted my axe or destroyed it. I did that earlier more. on accident. No. Oh. Um... But yeah, we we do have some rules that we follow and try to keep things performing on PLI. Alright, I'm on a roof now, so I'm safe. Like, really safe. They might tear down the whole POI, but they probably won't be able to. You're going to break the wrong block and then the whole thing's just going to come down? Yeah, I mean, they might collapse the POI, but they're not going to climb under the roof. <laughs> Okay. 
Uh, it's got more shit. Let's cover one time. Mm -hmm. I didn't see his first place. What did he say? Is it normal that the zombies spawned by the screamer can spawn inside the land claim blocks area of effect? I'm not sure if there's. I'm not sure there was code that ever stopped that, as far as I know. What would be your dream tier 5 POI location? At this point, I'd take just about anything, because we only have two factories um, and some skyscrapers. I'd take more factories, I'd take a mall, I'd take, I don't know, like a prison maybe, or I don't know, something. Um, we're uh, thinking and talking and working on it a little bit about what to do about that. They're just, they're very, uh, tier fives are very time consuming to build because they're so big. Oh. So we're trying to, we're trying to uh, solve the uh, production problem of how you cannot lose a designer for a month. Dude. That's how they were getting in. The door was gone. Oh, yeah. No primer electronics. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Okay. Lathan's Love Shack. <laughs> Sometimes they can't help, or I can't tell if they're trying to be helpful or just picking on me. It's one or the other. <laughs> A subway station would be cool. Um, I don't know if the American Southwest has them, but we could fudge it probably. Probably. We do already. We have other styles of buildings that probably don't fit in the Southwest. We don't need a Lathan's plumbing. <laughs> 200 toilets, no pistols. See, now you're being hurtful again. <laughs> I never find toilet pistols. Actually, it's funny because the one time I found a toilet pistol uh, was with, when it was me and Rick playing, and I was like, hey, yo, I, I found one. Do you want it? He's like, yeah, I'll take it. And I'm like, oh, man. I shouldn't have offered it to him. <laughs> hey, you can see the new uh, cell tower. <clears throat> There's a, oh, that? To the southeast. Can you comment on how many more experimental builds are estimated before stable? Can I? No. <laughs> no, not, a, <laughs> not even a little bit. Can Lathan? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, technically we can say whatever, but I mean, since we don't, I mean, I don't think either of us really honestly know the answer. It would just I, be I a don't, guess. I, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I would hate to guess on a number and then, you know, yeah, you go you're, one you're past asking, that and everybody's yeah. like, are you kidding me? Lathan said this. This is BS. He said it was only going to be two more when it was definitely four. Yeah, if I told you it was build 180 and then it was build 185, you guys would be, like, really mad. <laughs> oh, so, I'm not going to do that. Is it still on track? Yeah. I mean, we are definitely going to release it at some point. <laughs> that felt like a smart-ass answer. <laughs> it was... Well, you know. I we're mean, to take, we're, we're working on it. Of, we're trying to take care of, like, bugs and issues that would maybe not be fun for you guys to experience. Um, you know, if you ran into them. So, you know. Once, once some of those are out of the way, you can just stop Sean from breaking stuff <laughs> and add more from unbalancing stuff. Oh man! <laughs> yeah, 
you say 180 and it's 181, they're still going to rage? Well, I know that. Yeah. I mean... As opposed to going and working on a different... What different? What else am I going to work on? <laughs> I don't got time for another game. <laughs> I know. I'm busy making this game. How come the sort buttons are in the game's code but not active? Because they were not approved at the time. But uh, you will be seeing them sometime very soon. I'm not going to say when exactly, because I don't know if they're being pushed out with Stable, if they're being pushed out in the experimental before that, if they're being pushed out in 20. I mean, I really honestly don't know when they're coming, but I know we just had a meeting on it and just went over them, and yeah. So they will be coming in. They're not going to look exactly like what was there, but they'll be very close. You take inspiration when you're going around telling the stories. Do you ever take pictures to get ideas for layouts and for details? Some of the new commercial buildings feel so much more real. Than uh, well, that might be why. I, mean, I, I did look at a lot of real reference. And before the big COVID disaster, uh, actually right when that really ramped up here in the U.S., I had just gone to like CVS and Walmart and uh, Walgreens and places like that and I was like looking around at their loading dock areas in the back and trying not to get pulled over by the cops because you know you look suspicious like I was casing a place um looking around at buildings and stuff I'm trying try not to be obvious looking at buildings um yeah I was looking at real real world that's mm -hmm. the best way to do it okay you ready? Ready to do what? Uh, probably head to that quest. Jump off the roof and break our legs? I was trying to see if there was a low point. Yeah, there's a low <laughs> point. Come over here. It's fine. Look. Uh, Come, all on. Right. Come on. I'll help you down. <laughs> I know the way down. See? Yeah, I was about to say, you made this building. <laughs> it's a little tall. I might have to fix that. <laughs> Okay, so... We're not that far. We can go over there, knock out the quest, and then... And yeah, we'll no go turn that in. Maybe get some other quests. Did you spend your points? No, I didn't. I probably should. Yeah. I need uh, to make a new axe real quick here. You can repair it. Uh, it's no longer repairable. No. Hey, didn't you give me a tier two? No, 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 I left it in that box. Oh, I never got it. Mm -hmm. Silly me. <laughs> Should I run back or no? Nah, it's not worth it. Yeah, I mean, I'm it's gonna... just a tier two. I don't think it's gonna. Yeah, not gonna make any difference. Yeah, we'll probably find another one. I'm not running back for nothing. I'm not backtracking. All right, I'll I'll do my should I do my points really quick. Yeah, what sure. Just, just do? do them real quick. It's not a big deal. Uh, how about I'll do some lucky looter. And do I have any other points? No. Was that it? Yeah, just the four points. Uh, here, I was gonna, real quick. I haven't even bothered looking in my bag this entire time. Hmm. Okay. It's probably good. Good enough. Huh? How is it I have zero points? Did you finish the quest? The uh, 
the starter quest? Did you put down the campfire? No, I didn't. That's why you don't have points. Ah. I haven't played in a while. So can yeah, no, it's fine. Give me my own. You can come break some stone if you need it. Also, that the tutorial stuff is like probably the thing people remember the least. You know, when they pick the game back up again. <clears throat> Gotta have that paintbrush. We are ready to oh, take yeah. on this world. Oh, dude, nope. I'm having great luck with the uh, the tree stumps. Normally I don't get uh, honey at all. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get a knuckle rub animation. If I can get some of the artists to come on the stream, then you can ask them about it. We'll see. You're only finding honey because you're not infected? That's exactly it. with the bow. Oh. Except for right there. Like a rock. <sighs> Thought honey was in every stump? No. It is not. Mm, Any okay. chance at more paint options? Um, I think... I know we have a limit. Um, I don't know how close we are to that limit. Paint? What kind of paint option? I think just more paint options for them to, to paint with. Here's our quest, by the way. Like textures or? Yeah, yeah. Or I'm, I'm assuming the features of the paintbrush. Yeah, I'm assuming they mean the like, painting new textures. Hey, did you put down that uh, campfire? Because yeah. I can use cooking. It won't let me do anything. Perfect. Let's uh, put that on there. Put that on there. Wish I could grill some. Oh, I think, that's, I think that's a new stone. I haven't heard that one. And now you should have the points. Yeah, I do. Lucky. Where's that? On the feet. Should probably get healing factor. Yeah, I can never decide between stamina and, but I should probably get that fast metabolism. All right, there's a uh, two pieces of meat in that campfire for you. Yeah, I probably need charred. Oh, you like them. Oh, and here. Here's you a, a bandage to fix your health a little bit. You can just catch up some questions. I'm just like running around looking for rocks. Uh, let's see here. Um, are environmental hazards for POIs going to be expanded on to create a challenge? That I do not know. We would like to. Hmm? Yes. When making POIs, do you go into it with an idea like this POI needs to be fun? Well, yeah, every time it needs to be fun. Uh, I need really challenging puzzles or screw it, time to do something silly. All of the above. I mean, except for Lathan's you... hardware. Whenever he made yeah. that, it was just like, oh, let's just put some crap down. <laughs> so, <laughs> kidding, kidding, kidding. <laughs> Actually, that one I updated. Um, no, I know. I know. The, the, the old one was, was pretty rough. And <laughs> I, I, I gave it some love and made it not so shabby. But, uh, 
But all, yeah, the answer to the question is all of the above. Um, when you make enough POIs, it gets kind of hard to, you know, keep making them different or new. What is that rabbit doing? There's a rabbit just sitting there. Oh, and of course, when I decide to chase it, I decide to run. I'm going to run. No, I'm never going to catch that. Should we go do our quest then? Yeah, go ahead and hit the rally marker. Where did you go? No, I'm just sitting right here next to the rally marker. Like, oh, okay, sorry. I'm like chasing yeah. rabbits and you're like standing by the rally marker. And I lured zombies here. Just for you. Ah, that's fine. Man, you weren't kidding. Oh, wait. We'll kill them too. We got time. Yeah, yeah we got time. It's fine. And if we die, well, oh well. Part of the game. Hey, what do you think you're doing, buddy? And then this other guy is already. Alright. This is Brad's POI. And then I think um, there's going to be a couple of surprises in here. Oh, I've done this one like 100 times. This one's... Yeah, this is one of the surprises right here. You want it? Oh, I will take a blendy. Let me see what else is down there. You can't quite see what's in there. Nothing. Okay. Um, there you go. And here's some pellets. I love the blendy. Oh, and the new hay bales. Looking snazzy. Nothing in here. Sometimes there's a guy in here. Workbench. Yeah, Is it broken? Course. No. Not a working one. Right. It didn't have the uh, recipe. Alright. All right. So, let's get some of this garbage. Some feathers. Oh, you're already up there. Alright. Sounds like you got him. I need painkillers if you find them. Oh wow, that has a lot of stuff in it. Yep. Um, I'll take the pellets. Go. I mean, did you get lucky litter? I did not. Oh, I had it. So, yeah, I searched that chest. That's how I probably got a little bit of better stuff. I'm going to take that sledgehammer. Yeah, no, no. Take, take anything you want out of that. I'll take the remainder. Getting kind of full. We got to go find that last. Oh, I think it's those uh, boars outside. Yeah, and I think um, there's some guys banging on the walls. And Okay. Yeah, it's the out outdoor board. But we're gonna have to carefully try to assassinate. Oh, and I missed him. Maybe we should make some more arrows. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I don't really want to fight that boar. I don't either. I don't know why the level designers make us kill boars for the quest. It's like they should exclude it. Yeah, it is. Oh, no, it's going to kill me. Oh, you got him. That was it. <laughs> All right. 
Okay. Now we can run back and turn yep. that in, right? Oh, never mind. I'm not even gonna. Nope. This is Yeah. I'll keep that in mind for next time, everybody. I always forget to sneak, you know, like crouch to get the sneak damage. Though I feel like if the pig is looking me dead in the eyes, I shouldn't get a sneak damage. I mean, whatever. Okay, both on the wanders. Do I have any other food? Mm -hmm. You can 100% sneak, damage them nose to nose. See, that doesn't feel like something you should be able to do. Like, if it's staring at you, like, eyeball to eyeball, you probably shouldn't get a sneak bonus. What other POIs work? Oh, man. Uh... All the pyramid houses, a um, couple of the mansards, a bunch of bungalows, uh, like a whole bunch of houses from A17. Um, like half the stores, um, apartments at floor. I've helped update Deshaun Tower. I've helped out on. Um, Shamway Factory and Shaka Messiah and I'm trying I can't even think of them all. Probably like half the old West POIs. Um Oh my god, every time I don't know. Basically if you go into any category of POIs, um a bunch of them will be mine. Not all of them, but I try to get I try to get get some designing on every category if I can. But Mm -hmm. But Brad's done a bunch too, and uh, Alex and Rick have done some, and you know, and now we got Kernan and Sebastian making stuff. The new sawmill of Sebastian's and some of the new moderns are Kernan's. Okay, so I know you guys have brought this up before, but I don't know if we're going to do a candy store, just because the candies are supposed to be this like... OP thing that you have to get from the vending machines. I mean, we could. It would be mostly empty, except for the guaranteed loot that we want to place. That, yeah. You know, if we want, you know, it would be like I, yeah. looted already, mostly. But. Yeah, because we can't give them, you know, five or six stacks of candies. I mean, the candies are so overpowered. No, oh, man, I keep running. Sorry, I'm way behind you because I keep running out of stamina. No, 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 it's fine. I'm like hungry and thirsty, so my characters are like not running very well right now. Damn, you smell like the day. Now that you did the job, I guess you ain't all that damn bad after all. <laughs> that sounded even funnier, like through the walls of the <laughs> trader. Wait a minute, did he have sugar butts in the. Oh, oh the, ven the vending machine? Yeah. You should always see if they have Welcome to Trader sugar Jones. butts. I don't guarantee a thing. Malta like cocktails or batter up? Um, what's the batter up? Like which book? Uh, craft a metal chain to increase your knockdown. I think I'm gonna go with the Malta cocktails. Sure. That seems it seems more interesting for a stream if I set myself on fire. I thought for sure you're gonna have a full inventory and drop it on the ground and catch us on fire. No, maybe later. That's uh, yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna sell some stuff and then you can uh, hop in here. And... I'm checking out, catching up on chat. Actually, just letting you all know um, that bug where you, if you drop a Molotov, it catches fire. Uh, I fixed it this morning, so it should. 
I don't know what bill Joe are going to get in, but that shouldn't happen anymore. <laughs> Did you stockpile pallets of rock and concrete with an endemic? Yeah, my garage is filled with rocks and concrete. <laughs> It's kind of funny because I think someone was trolling all of you because there was a comment in the code that said <laughs> this makes it where the Molotov catches fire whenever it falls. <laughs> it was just in there like that. That's uh I don't know who oh, did that. <laughs> it just I don't know, everybody. I, I just don't know. Okay. No worries, Here, you can uh, done. you can now sell some stuff if you fucker. want. Oh, I should look for quest though. You can still do it. Uh, ooh, a fetch. 329. That's actually not that far. He, he won't take my paint, plant fiber clothes. And, and, you can just scrap them. Scrap those clothes. Anyway. I need painkillers. Mm -hmm. This has been like the mm -hmm. second stream where I've spent most of the stream with uh, the concussion. And then after the concussion's gone, then it's going to turn into, I find painkillers everywhere. Because that's what happens every time. I can't find them until I don't need them, need them anymore. And then it's like, hey, you can have as many as you want. Don't worry about it. Any plans for a Mega Crush string factor? That'd be cool. We should do more with Mega Crush. That'd be fun. That would be pretty cool, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> All right, now that we're done okay. doing business, get out of my store. Right? Yeah. And right, I have a quest on. to share with you. Yeah, I'm just gonna. Um, there's only one thing I want to get right now, and the rest is only. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Yeah, I'm gonna um, organize my inventory a little bit and then grab that quest for me. Okay, so currently in vending machines and traders, everyone does see the same inventory for sale. In Alpha 20, that's probably gonna change. How come there's a chance to find money in couches when dismantled, but no chance to find candy or food when dismantling vending machines? I don't know. We just probably didn't think about it. <clears throat> Um, what else? What else? Needs to have a shamway snack cake like a Twinkie. I could say it. Sean Shack Redemption. <laughs> Found some aloe and garbage in all places. All right. Okay, did you uh, grab that quest? I shared it with you. Yeah. Yeah, did it, does it automatically? I forgot. No, no, you have to press O and then go down to the bottom left, click it, and then click accept. Oh, yeah. I see it. That's right. right. And it said you accepted it. And then now you can shift click it in the list at the top and then it will target it. Like make it your active quest. <gasps> I found painkillers. Are you looking at my stream and you saw I didn't do something? No, shift no, no. Shift click it? I just... Oh it is at the top it is at the top of my quest. So. Yep. John's ham radio, I built that. I just, you know, made the quest okay. right so I know how it works. <laughs> Hey, hold on. There's a, in this trailer. There's some loot. Sure, we don't we don't have to rush for anything. I know where the good loot is. Any That's plans cool. to build POIs from The Walking Dead? Uh, we'd probably get in trouble for that.
Oh, there's two axes. I'll take another one. Is that the, uh, just the stone? Oh, well. That's something. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Uh, we did, but to follow up that Walking Dead question, um, we do want to do some POIs that are kind of like what they might have, like sur more survivor stuff and um, survivor camps. And we already have some survivor sites, so we could do more of them. And then I know I can't talk too much about like the end game or official faction locations. It's too it's a little bit too far away. But, yeah. Um, they know about the casino, but I mean that's. Obviously, everyone yeah. has the casino coins or everywhere that's the currency. But past yeah, that, there, yeah, there's there, there might be some more major like survivor camps coming in the future. Yeah, that's probably the easiest way to put it. You know, um, I was thinking about it. Ooh, hey, this one's actually ooh, eye candy. Holy crap! Let me get that. You know the the pre looting problem. We could just make it where if they loot any container in a POI before you hit that rally marker, that it just registers with the, the POI itself that you can't activate the rally marker for an hour. And that would probably mm -hmm. stop all that pre-looting. Since Joel made a big deal about it one time, which was funny because he made a big deal about it, and then the first time we streamed, he was like, I'm going to go pre-loot this. And I'm like... <laughs> uh, or you could just, like half the the loot list or quality you know so you could still loot but it wouldn't be as good as when you quest it yeah Did i dudes ever yeah. put that down not recently yeah. probably should uh, let me see oh here let's kill this zombie real quick and then we'll start this how do i know where the good loot is because i built that john hams poi The creamery would be so good, but there's like three zombies in the whole building. You should be trying to kill us. That one is what's called a remnant, which, you know, we got some complaints in A17 that, you know, and we, we kind of felt like it was a little too grandy ourselves, too. So we introduced what's called remnants, which are more empty POIs, kind of like the old POIs that are just like explorable. They might not have as good of loot, but they also don't have a million zombies in it. So not every POI is going to have tons of zombies in it. Any plans to make the wires for electricity longer and or the ability to hide the wires and not have them running all over our bases? No. I mean, that's, yeah. There are no current plans for that. Um, yeah, I think we've even discussed it and decided we weren't going to do that. Um, okay. Do you ready? Request? Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. I'm very curious. Is that still... Yeah, it's still the same one. Oh, yeah, I just thought about it. Do you want the blendy? No, I'm good. Well, it's just I grabbed an AK melee. while we were there. So I, I don't need the blender. Plus anymore. I think he's breaking out of somewhere. I'm gonna take some of these chairs for resources. Ooh, here we go. And then you just grab all of them. Uh, yeah, let me see. How come you give all the advantages to the... I, I, I'm not sure what you mean by that question. Um, some lockpicks. 
What about switches that can turn on and off from two different locations so you could open and close the door from both sides? I thought you could... I thought there was a way to do that already. Or you could just wire it directly from one switch to another switch to it or something like that and uses the pass-through. I don't know, I haven't messed with the electricity. Well, I say that, I haven't messed with it. I actually started fixing bugs with it the other day, but... I'm pretty sure with the pass-through wiring, you should be able to do exactly that by putting a switch on one side, putting a switch on the other, and then wiring to the door. And if either of those switches are flipped, it should open that door. And then if you don't want it to do that, then you put a, uh, a relay in between. Okay. I'm done looting. Okay. 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 Um, we might add something else to the electricity, but I mean, for the most part, I think the electricity system is, it will optimize it a little bit more, but I think for the most part, it is pretty much done, I think. Uh oh. Damn it. Get off me, bird. Oh, wait, I have vitamins. No, damn it, I don't. That's right. Always looking for something. We're gonna need to set up a camp soon. My dude's like starving. <laughs> Um, we probably should have bought some stuff out of that vending machine. Yeah. There's one right outside. Yeah. Okay, 12 pistol, 12 pistol. <gasps> Did you get it? Okay, so you yeah. actually got a toilet pistol. I, I really did get a toilet pistol. Um, okay, so do you want an AK or a pistol? Your choice. Uh, uh I, I don't know. I mean, I'll take either one. But are you like really excited about the pistol, or you just? I, want I am gun? kind of excited about the pistol. You can have the AK. Oh, okay. Or I mean, do you I'll want take, the pistol? Doesn't matter. I'll, I'll take the AK. Hold on, there's a couple guys like. See, now it's a used AK. <laughs> uh, yeah. Little bit. Little Actually, bit I have more ammo. Here, look, I dropped it on the ground right there. there. I had more ammo for the AK than I did the pistol. So. Alright, I have a pistol. Here, here's no, no me. Oh, okay. Oh, holy crap. Here's okay, well, I can see why you were. <laughs> Someone clip it. Yeah, we're never going to see that happen again, so yes. Hey, I found some food that I should probably immediately eat. Or I die. There you go. Did you get the, uh... You got the quest thing? Yeah, did you get yours? Yours is um, over here. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Okay, perfect. Are we out of here now? Uh, I mean, there's there's still the crates and stuff right here. Oh, okay. So more ammo for you. There's a blunderbuss in there too, if you want to have that as well. Where did you go? I'm I'm right beside you. Yeah, I'm sitting right here. Oh, you're hiding, like, right next to me. Um, in this reinforced chest right here, there's a bunch of things for you. Okay, I want to bang on this. Try to open it open with it my down. lucky looter that does 5%, whatever. There's some uh, pistol ammo in there. I'm pretty sure how the lucky looter works. Uh, whenever we loot them, it is actually taking ours as a party. 
and putting it together. I thought there was some sort of formula behind that. So that one person who had Lucky Looter doesn't have to be the one who loots it. It's just you give a bonus to both of us, basically. Because we're in a party. At least that was my understanding at the last meeting we talked about it. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's good that you have it, but I think, uh, yeah. It doesn't matter which one of us right. opens it. Now we just gotta get out of here. So, chop through the wall, I guess. That would we need those one, one way doors really bad. We really do. I was actually gonna mess with that at one point. And, <clears throat> and then life intervened. Yep. Just different things came up. That's the way it goes. But we definitely should get that in for 20, I think. There's so many places where that would be good for the loot rooms where there's a door. So you don't have to do what we're doing right now to kind of work our way out. There would just be a door you could only open from one side. I'll use the door that the zombies made. <laughs> All right. Now. Yeah, everybody, we've back. talked about that before. So it would, it would be hatches and doors that only open from one end so once you get into the loot room there could be a vault in there that you can open from the inside but from the outside it would say locked or jammed yeah we need that oh. are we going going too long uh, and as usual i forgot to use my uh my eye candy you know the stuff that helps with the loot Oh, yeah. and I purchased right before we went in there thinking man this is going to be great everybody oh you're getting well you're like walking a mile away from me maybe we should set up near the trader some more I don't know what's around here I look around again. um yeah, we'll look for a building pretty close by I mean we have enough time to have time to put this in, uh, like turn in the quest, and then we can pick one of these birds. Scouting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I will wear that. Could you make a lawnmower? A lot of people have asked for that. Like a functional one, or just like a prop? I think they want a functional one. I didn't realize you can't drop Molotovs for other people. I may have caught a few of us on fire. This is awkward. Yeah. I probably wouldn't do that for a little bit. <laughs> I'm sure everybody was really happy whenever you were like, Hey, here, let me give you a Molotov. I have one in my bag. I'm just going to drop it for you. Just pick it up off the ground. <laughs> or time charges. <laughs> yeah, I'd look that up. I think time charges. There's just a... Uh, I think there's just a setting in the XML that says on drop set fuse. Like, someone just needs to go in and set that to false. I'm pretty sure. I feel like Gaz was punking all of you on that one. He's like, I know how I'll get them. I'll make it where if they drop it, it sets it and blows up. Congratulations. Here's your reward. Uh, sucker. yes, the K menu is still out of the question. For what? What about um, the K menu? As far as I understand, they, uh, okay, so, once again, I am not the programmer who removed it, but... As far as I understand, it was removed because I think on a dedicated server it could, could corrupt chunks if used improperly. And so Alok removed it. Because sometimes people would lose parts of their server and get really mad about it. Any plans to add a bunker that you need to find certain color key cards for my game that requires you to level on game stage because zombies could be tough off given to you by a specific trader or what do. Uh, we've talked about different things to circumvent 
nerd pulling factories, and one of those might be like key cards or something like that. I don't know who, who would actually do that, but uh, but we we have talked about things that we can't get into um, without having them. Yeah, and everybody, the plan still is for as far as exactly what's going into Alpha 20. Uh, last time I talked to Rick about it, he said he wanted to have a stream where once we finalize the list, then we'd have a stream and talk about it. Obviously, we're not there yet, but when that time comes, that is still, as far as I know, the plan. Unless he has swimmer's eye, or ear, or one of those. Farmer's eye. Farmer's, farmer's nose. eye. He's got farmer. He's got farmer's nose. That's what it is. <laughs> Nerd pulling <laughs> should be illegal. That was perfect. When I said he's got farmer's nose, nose Trader Eric was like, ah, 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 ah. <laughs> "That was the best timing ever." Oh man. Uh. <laughs> Sell those. Okay, here, let's, uh, let's just get rid of that. Get rid of that, because it won't let me sell it. My one piece of paper isn't helping me either. I don't even know when I got glass. He should really complain at us whenever we just throw junk all over his store, you know. Like, that would be an easy line doing? to get. He's like, what are you doing? Trash in my place. Yeah. Stop that. It wouldn't be that hard to detect, honestly. It of course, you could just keep doing it. And then, then what would he say after that? Then you need, like, a, a nested layer of logic and lines. Teleports you out <laughs> or something, and then the door yeah. shuts and you can't go in or something? I don't know. He just pulls out a gun and shoots you. <laughs> Okay. Um, okay, I think that's that's probably good. Uh, we should probably go find somewhere to to live for the night. Then we can continue to answer questions. Oh, I'm gonna check for. I need some food. Um, I have a bunch of meat, but we need to um, get a base first and yeah. set up a campfire. Um. We could use that John Ham place that I built. That's pretty good. I've used that before. It's pretty sure. safe. They can't. Um, they have a hard time getting all the way up to the top. They do eventually. Like we'll work their way up there, but uh, it takes them a while to get there. So. Y'all notice he always says, "Let's use my POI because." <laughs> well, I know it's safe. I can't buy for anything else. Um, I'm kidding. I'm just giving you crap. I mean, these these single story. Ruined buildings. You could go ahead and make a base in there if you want. I don't know. I'm good. I'm good. Uh... Why can't I hit the oh the collider down low? I'm you know. consistently out of stamina. Yeah, we need a chest and like a campfire and. Um, did you go in the front door, or which way did you go? Front door. Okay. Right. There might be, like, one guy in here. This is a remnant, which is meant to be used as a base, if you need it. I mean, it won't be the most fancy base, but that's not what it's meant to be. It's not meant to be fancy. Um, I have some pink overalls here if you want them. Uh, I'm good. I'll wait for you to catch up. There's a specific way you can jump up here that's like the easiest way. There's a little bit of a jump puzzle to this. Yeah, you jump up on that. Yeah, there you go. I'm going this way. And then jump up onto here. And jump over here. And jump all the way up. Where the good food is. 
And I usually set up on top of this thing, actually. Uh, that's pretty, pretty good. I mean, I won't stop radiated vultures. Okay, so now that we are in a safe spot, that nothing is really going to mess with us. Uh, here, let's see. Are you guys taking any submissions for POIs for later alphas? If so, where can I place my idea? I love building and would love to throw my POI ideas at you guys. Didn't we talk about maybe doing a contest or something at one point? Yeah. I thought during you guys' stream. The, yeah, I think it was in the level design stream. Yeah. We, we, we'll we probably need to talk about it more, but, I mean, that seems like it could be something. When is Stable coming out? We don't know. Sometime soon everybody loves hearing that soon <laughs> when it's done yeah <laughs> now it, it is done it's just got bugs it's, yeah i mean well as you guys will just complain about the bugs and then yeah i mean i mean we could release it any time but then you all would be like well why the hell did they release it this <laughs> you know, why yeah. did they do that then you, then, you, then you just get annoyed and then you'd be like you'd be like why you? Why don't you? Why don't you release it? And then be like, why did you release it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> why don't you release it? Oh man, why did you release it like this? Yeah. Uh, exactly. We were all being very patient, and we weren't asking, and then you did this. When it's ready, but definitely before a twenty eight experimental. Yes. It's definitely going to be sometime after Alpha eighteen, and sometime before <laughs> Alpha twenty. <laughs> Somewhere in there. It's somewhere between those two numbers. <laughs> Everybody's like, I'm done. Screw you, man. I'm out. <laughs> and I can't do uh, Can you make a campfire? I don't have any stones. And my inventory is full, unfortunately. Yes. I got you. And then I have a whole bunch of meat to throw in there. I have well, a cooking grill. You do have a cooking grill? Good. I mean, I don't have the like the recipes to do anything with it, but I do oh, have it. Well, I'm probably not either. Did you put it on there? Yeah, you did. Cool. Yeah, no, you got to. Uh, yeah. I don't have any either. So, you have... I'm so expecting me to accidentally back up and fall off this thing, and then everybody's going to laugh hysterically. I'm never going to hear the end of it. Uh, yeah. The first thing I usually do in this location, I don't need rotting flesh right now. I'll pick it up in a minute. What we can do is... I can uh, get you started here. I'll get your safety safety ledge going. Yes. If I can, I might have to oh. fix a little perfect place a few things. Oh, there's a weapon back right there. Yep. I didn't get it. I left it for you. Aw. Just for the, 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 the CEO of Latham Hardware. <laughs> That failed business that we keep talking about. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, can't repair my axes because they don't have stones. I should probably go. Um, <clears throat> I guess we have to make charred meat. We don't have anything better than that. Wait. I knew I was going to say that. Do I have point. points? Excuse me. I do have points. Where's the food point? Where's the cooking one? It's under strength, I think. Master Chef. Bachelor. Okay, I spent a point. Now maybe I can make something. Yes. 
I can. All right, here you go. There's some stuff coming in. Uh, and I'm gonna go grab stone. I need to repair axes and stuff. You know, the only problem with setting up way up here is it's really hard to get up and down from here. Uh, <clears throat> we should build like a ladder at the bottom. You can just jump off. Um, I, that's the thing that I do. I, I thought we changed it to where the hay bale doesn't uh, break as much fall damage as it used to. Oh, did we? I mean, yeah, we did. Yeah. Don't don't try that. <laughs> okay, I won't try it then. I'll I mean, I, I think it. Uh, chat would probably know better than I honestly would because I don't normally use it. But I'm pretty sure it doesn't break as much fall damage as it used to. Can we well, build we elevators? Do, probably not. There's a, there's a couple tricks that we can do. We can make a ladder that's off of that um, that loading loading dock reef uh, since they probably won't be able to get on that loading dock. And then there's actually a shortcut you can just like climb up the side of the you can either cut a hole in the top of the um the 18 wheeler trailer or you can build a ladder in the side of the trailer and jump across there's a couple of tricks that make it pretty easy to get away from zombies that still be able to get up and down very easily yeah you know poi tricks yeah 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 yeah, yeah. oh i got gotcha. you I'm all trying to look down there without falling off. Well, I was going to upgrade those wooden frames, but I have no axe. So, like, first I need to get enough stuff to repair. Do you have any vitamins? We actually do not. We usually do, I know, but... Alright. So, can I make ladders yet? Why am I fatigued? It's rough. Do you see how high up we are? We climbed all this. I mean, that's, that's why I'm Tinsel fatigued. fatigue? No, I don't even honestly know why I'm fatigued. I don't... We need another threat other than vultures to get people on time. Uh, yeah. I mean, I think we will eventually. And we have like other zombie types that do crazy stuff I'm not gonna mention. Let's see. So you had to go and get a, a different crit, yes. It's like the game was like, oh, you found painkillers. Guess what? I'm gonna give you one that you don't have something to heal it with. Let's do fatigue. Okay, go. Is that? Oh, fuck. Is it now nighttime? Uh, I don't know. Seems like it is. Yes, yes it is. It looks a little bright. What's your brightness set at? Because I keep mine pretty high so that they can see what's going on. Uh, well, it just got darker all of a sudden. Maybe there's a delay on. Oh, I also just went inside again, but... Yeah. My, so, my brightness might be set up pretty high. On my um, screen, I have it set pretty high so that they can... It, yeah, it might be from the last stream that we did. Yeah. But I still have my brightness set up really high. What are you shooting at? That zombie down there. Oh, okay. I was going to try to get back up here. Mm. But I have no stamina. Was there a chest up here? Uh, actually, no, I didn't place a chest. Oh, wow. Okay. So I only shot one. It brought friends. It brought friends? Yeah, there's, there's like three. I can unlock them. 
All right, we got some storage going on finally. Oh, I don't want to get If we can't have now. flying bears, at least give us flying scorpions with magnums taped to them. <laughs> Probably not on both. Alright. So, now that I have this, can I modify... Put the... Where's the wood splitter mod? There we go. Now I have a modded app. How about that? I'm all fancy now. And... Oh, you just put the meat in there because you didn't have the recipe, right? Yeah, yeah, I didn't have the recipe. So I just kind of threw it in there. Figured you could start it up. There are some um, little bits of loot, like on the outside ledges of this thing, this building, so we may not have gotten all the loot. I'll go down and start trying to loot, because I do need to find vitamins. I, oh, I left my torch in P.Y. That's right. Uh... There is... If you see an open window... Is there a poppin' pills around here? all my own loot that I placed or not. I don't remember where I put everything, but did you you went down into the elevator, right? Well yeah I went down there but I'm outside now. Outside did you room. loot that little medical pile that was outside the elevator? Uh, okay here I'll double check. Let me get the garbage all here. Right. Oops. <clears throat> kind of hard to get to. So here's the elevator. Oh, you're down on the first floor. I'm in up where the actual elevator is. Okay. I might be able to get to it. Hold on. It's up there. Okay. Beginning. Solve the jump puzzle again. As long as I'm gonna jump puzzle on fire again. Trying, trying to be clever. I know. What is with you all? I'm trying to be clever. I'm basically standing near it. Uh oh. And then the dude is about to die. He probably could get that too. Oh. So, yeah, right where that elevator is. Look here. Left. Yeah, I see the... Oh, damn it, of course I fell. Ah, the jump puzzles are working. Free loot, but you gotta fall and get frustrated. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there has to be some cost to getting the loot, if there's no zombies. Oh, look at that. Vitamins. Did you get some? Yeah, I really did. Game is being nice to me now. See? The POI designers look out for you sometimes. <laughs> when we're not springing traps on you and stuff. I feel like that was more RNG than anything, but I mean, we can go ahead and say you did it. That's... 
So you put it there, I guess. You know, the containers. to start breaking. It's all good. Did you check the ledges outside? The windows? Oh. There's, there's stuff hidden away in a few places. I feel like this is your trick to make me fall off the side. And <laughs> well, if you don't see it right there, then it's not there. But there might be one somewhere. It would be funny if you fell, though, just because I told you to do it. That's not what I'm trying to do, but... But it would, it would be, be funny. Oh, yeah, okay. it would be funny. You put no leads on... Oh, man. Alright, well, I'm back outside. Throw away all that glass I just collected. I should probably turn off the fire to burn. Definitely need to eat more. Food. Probably. Did you eat some of this food? Uh, I ate one piece. I, I didn't really need too much. Oh, my guy was like starving, so. Yeah. I guess I don't really need anything. So yeah, if you all have any questions, um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm not gonna have any answers for any modding type questions. Hold on, I was a little low on stamp. Uh, I usually put a frame there. <laughs> did you fall? I almost did, man. I <laughs> I happened to push. I happened to push it's inward, it. and I. <laughs> it's like, uh, I slipped off to the left. All you need is like one frame, and it's like way easier. <laughs> it just it just startled me because yeah, I almost. That's <laughs> close. All the jumps were pretty much designed that way, where it's like, you can make it, but it's going to, it might scare you once in a while. I'll take a look at the switches tomorrow, uh, because the switch is just a trigger that is triggered by you pressing E, so it should nope. work with the others, but uh, yeah, I'll just have to look at it. Kind of messing with things in electricity at the moment anyway. Switch is what you play Animal Crossing on. Yep. <laughs> I didn't really get into Animal Crossing. I tried. I played the original one, and then now my daughters are obsessed with the new one, so I kind of started playing it again, and I'm like, hey, kind of like the Survival Craft game. <laughs> Where you just keep playing and playing. Switch only has an output, it doesn't have an input. That doesn't. 
He would have to get an input from somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> All right, Lathan's safety ledge is almost complete. Yes. Now it actually gets useful when you start trying to place. If you look at the bottom, of, well, over there, under the tool belt, there is a food and water bar. That's the green and the blue. It's all good. Alright, now Lathan maybe you won't fall. Yes. <laughs> you may have to put like the actual railing up <laughs> just uh, to make sure. Yeah. I mean we may have to do like a full safety net. Just build build, build a full concrete box up here that yes. you can't fall out of. <laughs> With uh, the door that I have to actually open and <laughs> you know Maybe use one of the electric doors so I have to actually flip a switch across the room so I know I'm not stepping out not, just yet. <laughs> you're not stepping into open air. Yeah. Oh, man. It's going to look scary, but you can't fall through these. I mean, chop the... Uh, it's just so you can actually place things like a forward through them. For some reason, I thought as you broke those, that like this outer ring part was just gonna fall, because it looks like this outer ring part is being held by that those pieces no. are breaking. No, it's against the high beam. <laughs> Not going nowhere in our fancy game world stability. Yeah, it takes quite a while. Um, I can't remember um, what day I got to when I had a base in this thing before, but I got pretty far. It was like 60 or 70 something. And they start getting up towards the top. It does start to get scary, but it takes a while. Yeah. And you do want to you do want to fight them back. You don't want to just sit up here because you you will really want to go down floors to fight them because they'll take out the building if you don't. So. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, you do have to engage them. You can't just sit up here all happy and ignoring them. <laughs> you end up collapsing eventually. Nice and close to the trader room. Trader, I mean. Yeah. Well, that's definitely good. So, any other questions, everybody? <clears throat> Favorite new POI? Favorite new one? Hmm. Like Alpha 19, yeah? Uh, uh, yeah, probably. I don't know. That's hard. Because, like, Brad and I work really, really hard on all of them. Uh, there we like them all in different ways. I like his uh, gun gun store O2 that has a big open arena in it. That's like a big obstacle. It's like a um, tactical course. That's pretty cool because we haven't built anything like that before. That one's pretty awesome. Uh, the new clothing store is pretty cool. They're kind of creepy because they have mannequins in them and stuff. We did some different tricks because they're not the usual POIs. Um, we couldn't we couldn't make them so linear because they're just like we would have had to build a maze inside of the big open floor plan layouts that stores have. So we had to kind of come up with different tricks like treat the open floor plan as more like an arena, and then have like choke points, you know, in the back areas or hallways or whatever. And, so they're, they're all kind of interesting because they all deal with that problem in a different way. I mean, some of them deal with them in similar ways, too. Oh, there's that team, I like. 
base is at bedrock. I don't know. I mean, I don't. I'd have to see somebody building at bedrock, and then we'd have to have a discussion about how to stop them from do, doing that. Do people We're, still do that? <laughs> I mean, I would think that once once the <clears throat> elevator um, hatch trick was taken out. I would assume people aren't doing that as much. I mean, I guess I can see some people doing it, but the fact that you'd have to, you know, use a ladder to climb all the way back out. Mm -hmm. Alright. So what are we doing now? I'm going to the trigger for another plan. Yeah, yeah. We just... Well, it's like, yeah, yeah, of course we're going to quest. We're just going to quest all day. Yeah, it's, uh... <laughs> How is the escort zombie looking? Looking awesome. I got some more, uh, some more meat. Yeah, there's, that's one of the hard things about designing the POI sometimes is, you know, just accounting for it. So many different people have different play styles. So we kind of have to build in. Ooh, I got a loot bag. Nice. It was, um... Just some padded boots. You want some padded boots? No. Oh, uh, actually, you know what? I will take uh, the padded boots. Uh, because I think I had the padded everything else. Yeah. All right. We're gonna go get a quest. That's still not open. Still got a Oh, that's right. Yeah. Uh, ways. I don't know for sure how the drones come in currently. Um, I don't know if you've heard anything about it. I know he fixed a bunch of stuff with it, but I don't know if it's, mm -hmm. you know, ready to even be tested yeah, yet. We haven't really had a, well, I, I haven't been in the meeting about it, so I don't know. Yeah. There's kind of a smaller sub-team of people working on that, so. Yeah. We don't, it's not what they're doing or not doing. It's not always shared with the wider team, you know, every day at least, so, um, I'm sure we'll get an update on it soon. Oh, they can't break through that because... <laughs> because the trader bounds. It's trying oh, to break through. Oh, the trader's through. right on the bounds of the... Yeah. Yeah. The trader's invincible bounds are right up against that. Interesting. <laughs> uh. I can just bang on it forever. Or we can break in another way and kill him. Yeah, I mean, it's just kind of annoying, so. Would like to kill it, just so. Uh, stop it. Well, we can reduce the annoyance right here. I will. Hit him with a sledgehammer. POI, I don't even know what it is. This is like a really old P1. A vacant lot or a car lot or a junkyard? I don't know. Something that needs to go on a list then. Probably. If it isn't already. You hear that, guys? It's gonna go on my list. That means this POI is in trouble.
We are not doing any knuckle rub animations, as far as I know. But, if I can get any of the art people to come on the stream, then you can ask them about it. I'm sure they'll say the same thing, though. Come on, trader. Open. We open in just a couple minutes. Well, not real minutes. Like 6.15? Fashionably late. Did you set that time? <laughs> I think it was... Okay, I think it was 6. And then I think we set it in the, the XML to be just a little bit after. If you like right. it, you buy it. All right, so jobs. I got. Do you want to do a dig quest? That's fine. Okay, so I got three ninety three. What do you have as far as yours? It's two different lists. See. I have a tier one fetch at one hundred and thirty seven meters. Oh wow, let's do that one. That's closer than anything. Right. Let's get one thing straight. It's actually one I haven't played out. It's one of Brad, so. It'll nice. be new for me too. I might have played it once a long time ago when you first finished it. I gotta share this sucker, so uh let me hit that button. Did you get it? Yep. Cool. Let's do it. Off we go. Wow, that is close. That was really close. Can we get red, yellow, and blue, green lights for electrical? Um, <clears throat> I can ask about it. I don't know if they're going to say okay on that. It'd be kind of cool. And I don't think it would really be that hard. That's just setting the color. I love this. Oh, is that the Ooh. coal mine? Yeah, dumping lung. It's so, all dumping lung. I got lagged the last time I went in there. Lagged? Yeah. So once I went to the underground part, it kind of lagged out my system. Let's try it again, because I'm actually kind of curious anyway. Because I was talking to Sean about it. <clears throat> okay. It was, that it was kind of weird that I was getting it. Uh, what's the real way yeah. in? That's that's how you come uh, the out. ladder. Yeah, I would assume the ladder. I don't know. I think I only played this once, like a it year was ago. Weird because like whenever I went underground. Oh, <laughs> uh, Brad got me with a fall trap. That's good. It's hard to do that these days. To get me with anyone. And I got my fetch already. Oh, mine's down below. Mine's in the hole. Hmm. Okay, so let's see if it does it this time. And I think we were on a server, so maybe that could have had something to do with it. It's hard to tell. Is it fine? I mean, is it? Yeah, it seems okay at the moment. I'm not. I think I was lagging here, so no, I think it's. I think it's fixed. Yeah, that was in the first... Yeah, it's fixed. That was in, like, when we were doing the... Like, right before streamer weekend. Oh, yeah, that was a while ago already. So. Yeah. There's been a lot of bug sticks. Yeah. And different things to change. So, okay, so... <clears throat> Alright. Uh... Don't forget to get the hidden stash crate at the highest point inside the POI. Who is it? Who, who knows this? Uh, is this an insider talking? Because no. I don't even know. This. <laughs> it's, no. it's one of the people. They, well, who they actually it. know a POI better than I do because this isn't my POI. So um, they have scoured this POI until they now know. Oh, okay. Let's go up here, I guess. Oh, and there's a zombie. Ah! 
Come on. That was good timing. I was waiting <laughs> for stamina. Hey, there's a guy up here. See him. I can just use my... He's down. I should start using my AK a little bit. Or maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. It's up to you. And I missed. I should use it if I'm gonna miss. I mean that hasn't stopped me, so. Well, yeah. I've been I've been missing like crazy. I forgot that he, yeah, I forgot he hit him in this little alcove. Where do you think he's going? Well, I have all these points. I haven't been spending them. You know, we should probably do that. What is this? Is this the final loop? Oh, yeah. We're at the end. Um, it says talk to the trader for me. I don't know about you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it does. You got your... You found your bag? Yeah. Uh, here. There's some ammo right there in that little drop loot bag. Well, there's some padded stuff and uh, a mod that I already have. Yeah, I'll take care of what There's is this? a hidden stash over here what in the you? corner. Oh, let's see. Mm -hmm. Shot in the side, great. Uh, let's see. That. Ooh, I will take that club, though. I will take that club. I need to get rid of some stuff. I have all sorts of crap on me. So modify that. Take that out. Sorry about that. Scrap that. Is this the way out? Yeah. Modify that. That there. Oh, nice. Brad even made a way out. Oh. Kind of. Oh, you can break your way out pretty easily. Oh, let's see. Modify that. Take that out. Yeah, we really do need those one way doors. Yeah. Okay. I didn't realize I had oh. a med kit. Hello. And I'm still just, just holding the, on to this uh I should let this guy break out. This eye candy. For some reason. I'm not using it. Come on, buddy. Break it. What, am I going to do a blade build? I don't know. Maybe we'll do it one of these times. We end up having to reset so often that, yeah, maybe. <laughs> I just like letting them break into the thing for me. I mean, I don't have to work. Yeah, my axe is broken. We're free. I didn't need repairs. I did repair. Let me go back. All right. Well, we can go back to the trader now. Right? Yep. I need. That's weird. Food. So, so I am feeling a tiny bit of lag right here. Like oddly oh, yeah. in front of the building, it's just a little bit. It's not. It's not a whole lot. It definitely feels like it slows me down a little bit, but it, if I walk away, I'm fine. Huh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, hold on, hold on. They said that there's a hidden stash at the very top. Yeah, that would make sense. We try to be sneaky like that once in a while. Damn, uh, I fell for it sure too. Would... Literally. Oh, I see. He made a jump puzzle. Clever. I don't think I ever found this. Designers and the jump puzzles. Oh no! Okay. Yeah, see? He wanted you to do that. He wants it to be tricky. No! Okay, you do it. Yeah, I'll do it. I get what he was trying to do. What? There's only a primitive bow and a weapon flashlight mod in here. Do we not put gold and stuff in these anymore? I guess not. I didn't know you I, ever did. I mean, <laughs> I used to get like gold and diamonds and all kinds of crazy stuff. And yeah, we have been getting robbed then. 
Because I don't remember getting that at all. Yeah, that was a while ago. That was definitely nerf. I will take these stones. Now that I can see them in the daylight. Yeah, the golden diamonds are definitely in the buried treasure maps. Craft special here. ammunition and used to breach secure blocks like pay. doors, safes, and vaults. Sure. Mm -hmm. Let's see. What's your problem? 127.62 ammo? I think I'm going to take that. Yeah. That was, good. that was pretty good. Now, can I sell anything to him? Like, I know I can't Probably. Sell my permit, but I can't sell be. nothing to him. Wait, why not? I can, but I just don't have anything worth while. I would go through and just. Anything we're not going to be using. Just to free up a little bit of space. Is there water around here? There's a swimming pool on a house. Oh, I have water on me if you need it. We should start. I have mineral water. Stuff. All that damn gawking here, I'll grab us some buried all supply. You want work also. Oh, okay. So that's got food and drink. Oh yeah, I forgot that I added that sound. <laughs> I gotta give you your other ones, the leaving party and stuff. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. Boo! That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> Did I not accept it? I'm not accept it. There you gotta hit O and then click. Yep, there you go. No, I just forgot to do it. Should it automatically do it when you're in a party with somebody or no? Well, maybe you don't want to, so I don't know. Yeah, that's that's the only reason currently is you may not want to. You may be like, screw it, I don't want to do your quest. You do it. Especially if you're someone who's, so let's say, even though there's no reason to use the system this way, I know everybody does, but you could be, you could have someone sitting back at the base while three people are going and doing a quest, and you all four are for some reason in a party, even though the other person's not even, like, with you. Yeah. So I could see... No, I mean, I, yeah, I case. get it. I get it. It's just, I, I wish there was a way to, like, skip the extra step if, like... Yeah. There's no way for the game to know that I want to join the quest. You know? Yeah. Oh, this one again? Oh no, this is no, very, no, no, no. We're, yeah, it's we're like really right. close to where we did that quest then. Yep. I see it. It may be under the road. Mm. Mm. It's a little bit. Crap. Mm. Ah, we're fine. I need to start shooting my gun now. Yeah, probably. Because I have tons of them on me. <laughs> Why do I have... Okay, get rid of that. 
and then I have it. Okay. Need to make a shovel. Yeah. Alright. I'm trying to get him encumbered. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, the face bitch. <laughs> Did you drop me one? No. <laughs> I just thought you were going to make you one there. Here. Oh, I thought you said you want me to make you. No, one. no, no. I said I you need to make a <laughs> shovel. Oh, I don't even have the plant fibers for it, even though maybe there's plant fibers all over the place. Ow! I was trying to get a drink. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, that. No, oh, that's All right. I clicked the wrong thing. That. I just wasted. What? I just wasted just herbal wait. antibiotics. Oops. Actually, I just wasted two different things because then I accidentally. Oh my god, I just. You know. I wasted honey and herbal antibiotics. Oh boy. And yeah, there's a man, zombie man. right in front of you. Oh. Alright. Man, she snuck up on me. Alright, I got my shell one now. Not a really good one, but. Mine's only number two. And I'm not, I need to eat more soon, that's why. I just let my stamina return for me. I think I'm going to be changing this to use a uh, rally marker, a buried supply quest. I heard the shrinkage sound. Yep. That worked for sure. Shovel already needs a repair. I hope someone named the sound file being used as shrinkage sound. Sadly, it's not called that. I need to eat like so bad. <laughs> Not red yet, but it will be soon. Uh, wait. No. Okay, I thought I. He leans in to look. I do that too. Yes. I, I definitely do that. Whenever I'm trying to look around corners in games, I end up like... <laughs> I knew it was like under the tree. Why did I... I had a feeling... Oh, hey, there's a... There's a wandering horde coming at us. Oh, that's not good. 
They may want to well. just come out for a minute. There's, wow, there's a lot of them. One hit. There's a lot. I want my XP. Oh, and there's a guy behind me too. That guy is. You guys have good weapons for day three? Yes. I mean, I don't know about real good, but it's a They're all right. tier one. Tier one AK is not great. That's why it was so cheap to buy at the trader. But I think in Alpha 20 you won't even be able to buy it. So. There, oh, there it is. is. Okay, so go ahead. You um, go ahead and loot. Really, you can loot it all if you want, and we'll just share it afterward. And then all stand right. out of the hole. As soon as I loot it, it's the zombies are going to spawn. Mm-hmm. Yep. And they're here. Hey guys. Yeah, it feels like they spawn way further than they normally do. It'll be like uh, the loot. It'll be tiered, kind of the same way. You won't be able to find the... You'll probably be able to find a little bit better than what you can find in loot at the trader. But it won't be like it is now where you find just, you know, whatever. <laughs> Did you see this one? <laughs> Oh, she's despawned. Well. Alright. I mean, it's all food, mostly. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, eat, eat as much as you need. I probably need a little bit. I'll eat. Well, there's... Here. Want some ravioli and lamb cuts and... Yummy. Okay, let's go head on. Oh man, I got my stamina back. There you go. Now I can actually move. Yeah, we need your stamina back. <laughs> I heard my I heard myself. I heard that little crawler guy following us. I thought you killed the crawler. Uh, it was a different one. He's oh. back there. He's hung up on a sandbag. I'll, uh... I was about to say, I think you can outrun him. I think we're... <laughs> I think we can get away. I need like one more point into um, pack meal. I think I'll be okay. Is there an XML setting for loot bag despawn? I do not believe so. Don't think that's something we let you configure. Or I could be wrong. Oh, you know what? That's probably in the entities. Or entity classes.xml on the bag itself. Never mind.
Yeah, on entity classes. Yeah. Well, okay. Here, boy. We got oh yeah. Two hundred nine millimeter ammo. I'm ready for horde night now. State your business, fool. Congratulations. Here's your reward. First aid kits. I think I'll take them. Ooh, that's not bad either. Can I sell them anything? I would go through it. I I normally just go through and click like everything that I'm like, I don't really care about this. And just try it. I think it's W to sell. So I just like go through and click and click W. Mm. Yeah, I want to keep. Well, yeah, I don't have enough of value for some. Make sure there's that isn't more valuable. I'm gonna leave some paper behind me. It wouldn't take four paper for me. Now I can get mine. How's your AK doing? Uh, it's about. Two thirds. Okay. Why wow, you got some repair kits? Well, I was looking at he has repair kits for sale. Ooh. Okay, so if that was the Night Stalker book that made it where you weren't encumbered at night, I would buy it. That is my favorite book. But. You should make blood moons every three days. I probably should. Um, these team ones. So the plan was, which I've said this before, the plan was to have one save game. And just at the end of the stream, we would just, whoever's playing with me would dump all their stuff into a container. And then we would level up the next person to the level I am. And just continue. Like as if we started the game together. And just keep doing that with every team member that comes in. But the uh, the save game got messed up. With one of the last experimentals. And so yeah, we had to start over again. It's all the progress that Sean and Robert took part in. <laughs> we had to restart, so... <clears throat> so yeah, it might make more sense to just say every three days. Because then we could end the stream on a... Uh, on a little horde night. Which I think right now we'd be fine for a horde night. Like you got a bunch of bullets, I got a bunch of bullets. I have Molotovs, like 20 Molotovs. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think we'd be... We could be fine. Um, I was gonna go get some water at the POI that's over here. That's oh, sure. Well, here, do you want me to just give you some bottled water? I have, like, the good... the good stuff. Good stuff. Ooh. Yeah, I got the purified mineral water. I got like seven of them. Yeah. Maybe uh, I'll grab six some of them. too. I'll grab some extra. Just make sure, sure we have some. Uh, let's see. I don't like carrying around empty jars without filling them. <laughs> I always throw away all my empty jars. Oh, you just throw them away. Just, yeah. Speaking of. Uh. Uh, what typically is the degrees that a screamer will spawn there? Wait, what? Uh, and two forges, two get, and I constantly get hounded by them. Uh, I'm not sure. That would have been a perfect question for last week whenever Sean was here. As the owner of that, well, the current owner of that system, he could probably could have told you. Yeah, we may do that. We may start um, setting it to every three days there's a horde night. Or on day three. Oh, take that. What's up? Oh, oh, you're fighting zombies out there. I was like, what? I heard zombies. I guess that was you. Yeah, I'm punching zombies in the face.
Oh. We're up on the building. Let me look around real quick. Let's see what's around us. Who's gonna... Just go do another POI. <clears throat> there was something interesting. Right. It's a lot of the bigger POIs over here. Shamway Foods. I think the hospital's back over there somewhere. There's that. Uh, that's another one of the. That's another factory. What else is there? Clunky Oil Company. Yeah, that needs an update. That's, That's my electric company there that needs an update. That was one of my, that was like my second P1 I ever made. Hmm. Yeah, it's got old two dimensional trussing. It needs an update. Shaka Messiah. Trying to see a little bit down the road. As I lean side to side to kind of. See if I can see just a little bit further around the corner. As if I don't understand how computers work. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I can see it. Hmm. I mean, there's a lot of bigger ones. There's not really that many. This one didn't really get too many of the the smaller good ones. It's like I, I mean I think we should go clear a POI, but I mean not like Shotgun Messiah or anything. You know what uh, I mean? Like we need like a, a smaller one that's not gonna take us too crazy long. But did did we clear the creamery? This creamery might be alright. I think it's a I don't remember if it's a lemon in requestable. Uh but it might not be we can do that. Might as well. We got about 15, 20 minutes left of the stream. We can go a little over if need be, but... Let's see. Um, let's see. <laughs> lean, lean. Yes. That's, that's what I do. At the creamery. Yeah, I'm inside. I'll be there in just a sec. I basically just am at the first room. I thought that was you trying to punch the wall. <laughs> no. Okay. Right. I am here. Let's do it. Alright, so I killed the guys in this room and that was it. I didn't get very far. The workbench. There's some stuff in there. No recipe. No. Maybe just some lumber. Any 
anything in those? I don't remember. I don't see no, anything. not in that one. There's a backpack down there. Come on, get it. Ooh, scrap boots. Okay. And, I don't know if there was anything in here in the bottom. There probably... I don't know, I don't see anything. I'm gonna go back in. Okay. I found vitamins. Oh, nice. Don't really need them now, but... Wait. Oh, there's a bunch of ammo here, too. Where did you go? Oh, are they jumping on us now? Yeah, well, I was fighting them, and I... Yeah, I guess they're down there with you now. Well, they were. Like, because they were up here. Yeah, this little office. Yeah, that's, that's kind of nice. Moving out onto the roof. It's a move. More jump puzzles. Oh, great. Because I'm so amazing at those. And we found the end. Up the ladder. There's a bunch of guys. You can it. Did you them all? I think we got them all. I think. Guys down in the ground. What's this guy doing? Cans. Okay. So is there something over here? I don't know. This is Brad's top secret Man. hiding hole somewhere. I don't know. He has the thing hidden. He might. We don't always hide something. Possibly, but probably not. 
so. No. Nope. <laughs> All right. Yeah, there's probably nothing. He's watching right now, like. <laughs> yeah, he's watching. Suckers. <laughs> there is one yeah. secret room you have to jump to. I don't know if we want you to spoil it for us. Oh my god, I almost fell off the side. Never gonna live that down if I do. Oof. Yeah, I see my water work. Okay, well, um, since it's about to be nighttime, this might be uh, a good enough time for us to stop. Um, yeah, because, I mean, we're not going to do much at night. Is there any last minute questions anybody has for Eric uh, while he's still here? If not, we are probably going to call it. And I'm sure I can talk Eric into coming back um, at some point. Trying to spread out the team and, you know, uh, try to get different people each week. That's about the only A19. I don't... Wait, this one is the only one you don't like? Ooh, there's one. Eric, how many times would you say you play test a prefab before calling it ready to release? Depends on how complex the prefab is. Um, like if it's a big a big one, it would be a lot of times. Um, but like if it was a small tier one, say if it was like a small tier one house, I might play it. Mm, I don't know, four or five times. Um, but something that's like a tier two or tier three and up you might have to play it like 10 times or 15 times just to make sure you covered everything um but i usually make lists like when i see things while i'm playing that are wrong or not fun or problematic i'll, I'll make make put it in a list and then i just go back and hit all the things on the list so i you know it's not like i have to play it like a hundred times to get it right Let's see. Uh. Uh, any news on possibly adding new weapon types or items? Um, I think that's a question for a different night. I don't know if we really have any plans of adding any new ones, but uh, that's probably the night I get Joel to come back. That would be the night to ask that one. Because I'm sure I can talk him into coming. Um, let's see. Uh, do you play test at different game stages to see if it feels fair for the expected loadout? That's you, Eric. That's at different game stages. Uh, no, not so much. Um. The loadouts we have are based on like where we think the player should be. Like at tier two, it's like you might have a really bad pistol, like a tier one pistol, or you know, quality one pistol over there, um, and a club. So it's like a tier one or two POI. It's like if you run through it with those, that's probably about what the player is going to have by the time they're doing, you know, tier one and two quests. So. Yeah. Uh, we don't we don't do a lot of different variation testing with that because it's like well what if a player's level 100 I mean but they're playing tier one quests <laughs> like but we would have to test like every possible configuration and it's not really useful it's more about testing what 
you know, the level the player's at for that tier, you know. Cool. Um, all right, well, everybody, I think we're going to end it here. Um, thank you again for being here. Uh, yeah, and thanks, Eric, for filling mm -hmm. in. Um, 